What's up YouTube, this is Madcock83 with an addition to my mod pack for Buildcraft that I uploaded yesterday. This one by request is going to include industrial craft and let me tell you it was a bitch to figure out. It's been about six hours today on this whole video. I also tried to add you guys a HD texture pack but I can't get that to work yet. I'm still going to work on that for now. Only put regular standard 16x16 uh, texture packs in there. Right here is the download I have for all the mods I have. But I'm still trying to get permission from all the mod creators to let me post it. <clears throat> As for now, this is everything we're going to be working with right now. I counted 25 total downloads. So I would suggest going through my description at the bottom of the video and just downloading as much as you can try to make them a, a mod pack folder on your desktop like I did and just throw everything in there put all your red power in one your build craft in one and your industrial craft in another so we might as well get started with this one. First thing you want to do find your uh, minecraft folder percent app data percent unless you should know how to already find this if you're willing to do this mod you ought to know uh, first thing you want to do take your minecraft folder drag it to your desktop this will be your backup in case while you're doing this everything just goes to shit you can always just drag that one back in here start up minecraft it's going to generate you a new minecraft folder uh, put in your information and log in. It's going to download all the new Minecraft jar, all the folders you need to get this one done. <clears throat> Once you hit the Mojang screen, you've already got it done. Now, first thing you're going to do, go back into your Minecraft folder right click it and add a new folder type in mods just M-O-D-S go into your bin folder open up your minecraft jar with winrar or winzip whichever one you prefer to use delete this meta inf first thing first and foremost it's gotta go or else you'll get a black screen um, the way we're gonna do these mods is we're going to put everything that needs to go in the Minecraft jar first and then the rest of the mods go into your mod folder that we just created some of the mods we're going to put in the links I put in are straight to the downloads they don't go to the pages now in the description it's going to say too many items and then the link if you want just type in too many items in Chrome or whatever and you'll get the Minecraft forum page and you can scroll down to each one of them. This is for too many items. This is for mod. This one's for mod loader and your audio mod. If you just type in what it is in Google, you'll come up with these forum pages. Um, the only one that's different is going to be Industrial Craft. You're going to get your mods. For, you're going to get uh, what you need to download from this page because the Industrial Craft forum page is more up to date than the forum is and same thing with Buildcraft Space Toad's website is more up to date than his Minecraft forum page is right now now back to the mod first thing we're going to install is too many items open it up with WinRAR Highlight everything and drop it in. And the next we're going to do is mod loader. Highlight everything, drop it in. The next one is mod loader MP 1.8.1. That one's in. The next one we're going to do is for industrial craft. 
you want to put this mod loader mp dash client fix it's only one file in there drop it in then we're going to minecraft forge client 1.1.1 grab all, all the junk in here drop it in your jar we're going back up to industrial craft you're just going to drop this one file in there now do what I'm doing in the order I'm doing them in it's the only way they get to work if you try to put it, install build craft before industrial craft it may crash if you try to you know you get what I'm saying <coughs> Now go back to your Minecraft folder. In that mods folder we created, you're going to put, I'm going to copy and paste. You can drag these if you want. I'm saving them. I'm trying to, I'm saving my mods in one folder for other videos. You can either paste it like I did or you can simply grab it, drag it, and drop it in there. Just make sure you put it in the mods folder, the one we created earlier. next one we're going to do is audio mod this one goes in your minecraft jar next we're going to do is single player commands this one's got two parts you see this world edit jar the first thing that's up there click underneath it drag every file that's underneath it into your minecraft jar also, when you're putting stuff in a jar, make sure you're dropping it on top of these fat uh, class files and not in a folder, because it may actually drop into a folder and not work. Just make sure you're dropping it on top of the classes. Um, the second part to single player commands, you want to go into your bin folder, where, where you opened up your Minecraft jar, and drop that world edit jar in there. And that's it for single player commands. Next one we're going to do is wireless redstone. This one goes in your jar. <coughs> and close that one out. I have, <coughs> excuse me, I have an additional uh, wireless redstone clocker, which is an add-on to wireless redstone. I like it better than the ones in some of the other mods. You don't have to do this, but I'm going to just because I like it. You'll have to download it separately from Wireless Redstone. It's down towards the bottom of their page uh, as an add-on. Uh, let me just scan through real quick, make sure we got everything we're going to put in there. Everything else is going to go in that mod folder that we created earlier, so you can close out your Minecraft jar. And this is the dot minecraft folder from earlier open up your mods we're going to put buildcraft in there the newest one's 2.2.4 came out yesterday i'm going to copy and paste like i said you can simply highlight them all drag them all over in there and drop them if that's what you want the next one's going to be red red power which is seven downloads, seven separate downloads, which each one has an odd uh, five second ad fly link on them. So enjoy waiting for that shit. I'm having issues. Copy, paste, or drag over, whichever one you prefer. I like to copy and paste because when you drag them over, they're not in your folder anymore they get into your Minecraft folder which sometimes gets deleted when stuff doesn't work right um, after that one you want to put a equivalent exchange in there I keep doing it uh, next one's the last one is going to be additional pipes this is for build craft paste it 
That should be everything. And we're gonna switch over to Minecraft to make sure everything worked. All right, we've got Minecraft open. I've uh, installed a test world. I just created a test world. Now we see single player commands are there. We open up our inventory. Uh, get an achievement. We got 13 pages, so that's pretty good. <coughs> Some industrial craft items. Oh, put the jet back on. Pain brushes. If I remember right, a part of red, red power. There's our equivalent exchange items. Uh, there's our part of our build craft pipes. Those three right there are teleport pipes. That's uh, additional pipes made it. And here's all our oh these are all industrial craft machines. Uh, there's some red wiring components. Here's all our build craft pumps and engines. Wireless redstones right there. These are also part of uh, red power. These are the lighting blocks, which I really like. Do a quick demo on them. Some redstone. I love this laser gun. There's a transmitter. And you can pretend these are all the way across the map. Just set it to whichever frequency you want. Put this one on one. I'll also make this one on one so when we power that one, wirelessly send it over here. Put a little redstone light blocks. Boom. It turns red, so it means it's sending power over there, and the light block comes on. There's no redstone. Boom. So that's it. Everything made it. Well, since all that worked, everything's done. Um, please rate this video. I'm not asking for the rates for personal reasons. I want people to know how to do this and add all these things together. The more rates it gets, the higher in search it comes up. Uh, if you want to subscribe for anything else coming out, I'm planning on doing some spotlights on these mods I've added, plus a few more, just to kind of show you what they do in case you haven't seen them. Um, I'm a big fan of Buildcraft. I like playing Buildcraft. Um, I appreciate you watching. I hope it's helpful. Leave some comments if you have any questions, and I'll see if I can get back to you. I'll probably try to PM you if, if something doesn't work right. I'll do my best to help. I appreciate you watching. This is Madcock83. Have a good day.